The third book in Crooks is about uh, a small catalogue I made for Celsia, again with uh, Damien de Lepelev. Um, and again, we will find the typical text of these days with the footnotes in a column juxtaposed to the main body of the text. Um, again, the text does not really talk about the work of the artist. It doesn't talk about the sculptures or his paintings because I had the impression I um, I didn't see them, and I think I was right. It was too early. It was too early um, in my training as an art critic or a spectator to really understand what Xiao Xiao was doing. I love Xiao Xiao, I love his work. I met him again in 2010 in Shanghai and Nanjing. Um, I repaid him again. Uh, what can I say about it? Um, yeah. Later I understood, for example, why he always uses the color red. I think the color red refers to the emperor and the grain, the earth, the yellow river. Um, and the emperor and the people, the emperor and the, the peasants are one. And uh, the administration between them is super superfluous. I think it's a political statement hidden in um, hidden in um, gold. Is uh, of course is linked to the grain also. The political statement that has taken on. Um, a formal disguise. Dit is het derde boekje dat ik heb gemaakt over het werk van een Chinese schilder Xiao Xia die twaalf jaar in België heeft gewoond en die een vriend was van mij. Uh, opnieuw ziet u teksten met uh, de voetnoten in de kolommen opzij. Opnieuw drie talen, Nederlands, Frans, Engels. De tekst uh, gaat vooral over Walter Benjamin en Charles Chaplin. En niet over de schilderijen of de beeldtouwwerken van Xiao Xia, want ik begreep die niet, ik kon die niet zien. En dat schrijf ik ook. Um, ik moest nog veel leren toen. Um, uh, voici le, le troisième livre que j'ai fait moi-même, le quatrième auquel j'ai participé. Um, um, ce livre traite de l'œuvre du peintre Xiao Xia, Zhang Xiao Xia. Euh, qui a vécu 12 ans en Belgique et euh, que j'aime beaucoup, que j'aime toujours. Euh, et voilà. Euh, C'est tout ce que j'ai à dire là-dessus pour le moment.